guys today's absolutely beautiful day here in Helsinki it's very sunny it's warm it's perfect day to wash carpets and uh, I'm gonna show you how Finnish people are washing carpets because they're doing it a totally different way that I would ever think of washing carpets when I lived in Rovaniemi I was washing carpets next to the river shore but here in Helsinki I'm actually gonna wash carpet next to the seashore and here we are this is the place and now I'm going to show you how we do it here in Finland. The carpet washing piers are called Mattolaitur in Finnish. They are owned by the city of Helsinki and you can use them for free. I found a table and now I'm starting to get ready to wash my two carpets. Here's how it goes. To wash the carpets you only need to bring a bucket, a brush, and the environmentally friendly washing liquid that you can buy in almost every grocery store in Finland. First thing you have to do is to pour the water on your carpet, put the liquid on it and brush it until it gets clean. After that you rinse it and take it to the place where you can squeeze the water out of it. So this is the place where I'm gonna squeeze the carpet, I'm gonna squeeze the water out of it before I let it dry. Carpet. And now I'm gonna take it to the place where I'm gonna dry it and I'm gonna keep it dry for maybe an hour. Maton pesulas are placed on Finnish lakes, rivers and the seashore. You might be asking yourself how can you wash carpets with the sea water? Yep, I asked myself the same question and here's the answer. Finnish Sea is part of the Baltic Sea. The northernmost arm of the Baltic Sea is Botnian Sea and the easternmost arm of the Baltic Sea is called the Gulf of Finland where Helsinki is placed. Because of the combination of the shallowness of the sea and surrounding lakes, streams and rivers that are flowing into the sea, Gulf of Finland has very low salinity, between 0.2 to 5.8%. To simplify the whole thing, let me compare it to the Adriatic Sea in Croatia. Baltic Sea has the salinity 0.2 to 5.8%, whereas the Adriatic Sea has around 38% of water salinity. This explains the fact that your carpets won't be salty at all if you wash them on Finnish seashore. Cheers! <laughs> What I really like about washing carpets on Mattolaituri is that it is so meditating. I really relax and completely forget about everything while I'm washing carpets there. Washing carpet place is mostly used from May until September in the warmest time of the year in Finland. It's kind of logical because it takes some time to dry your carpets even in warm sunny days, so it would be a bit chilly and problematic to wash it and dry it during colder months. Obviously, you cannot use Mattolaituri during winter because of the snow and frozen sea.
There are 12 matto laituris around Helsinki and they're all located next to the seashore. They're not planning to build any new ones in the near future because the current ones are in a very good condition, as you can see. My first carpet washed on Matto Laituri was during the time when I lived in Rovaniemi on the river Kemioki. The only issue I had was carpet washing liquid. I didn't understand why do people destroy nature, but actually most of the carpet washing liquids are environmentally friendly and you can buy them in almost every small or big grocery store in Finland. If you're not sure where you can find Matto Laituri in the city, Try to find out. It's fun, it's meditating, it's environmentally friendly and it's 100% free. And don't worry, when you leave your carpet to dry, no one will steal it. You're in Finland. It's done. I'm finished. I just have to wait that the carpets are dry and then I can take them home. Thanks for watching the video today. I hope you learned something interesting about how Finnish people wash their carpets. And see you next week. Bye!